Hi, I'm Fred Fidua, site coordinator for the Care of Boston Performance Group at the Morton Arboretum in the western suburbs. We know Boston Marathon has a lot of hills and running up hills is important, but just as important is to learn how to run downhills so you preserve your energy for the end of the race. Running downhill has two components. The first is form. So what is the proper form for running downhill? Too often we do this to stop ourselves, right? You've done this. You dig your toe in when you come down the ball of the foot and that slows you down. You don't want to do that for two reasons. One, when you do that, it stops your momentum, which you don't want to do when you're running. The second is that drives all those forces all the way up your leg and that is not good for your leg. What you want to do instead is you want your foot to act like the rocker on the bottom of a rocking chair. So when your foot hits, you want to hit midfoot and just roll forward. So you hit midfoot and you just roll forward. And that is going to take that energy, transfer it forward and propel you forward so you can go downhill. Now, what if we do it for going too fast? We've been there before, right? We're going too fast. So what we do, our break, is if we just move back and forth from our ankles. If we're going too fast, we slightly move back from our ankles. If we want to speed up, we lean, in to, lean into our ankles. And again, we keep that form exactly from the heel all the way up through your shoulders. I said there were two components to running downhill. One is form, which we just talked about. The second, quite honestly, is fear management. And that is just overcoming fear when you're running downhill. And that's why you need to practice. Take these techniques we've talked about on form and go out and practice running downhill. If you feel you're running too fast when you're leaning forward, just lean back a little bit from your ankles. You don't lean too far back because it's going to slow you too down. Play with that a little bit until you get confident. And you actually have to practice running downhill. So that's the two components of running downhill, form and fear management. And now you have to practice and practice a lot on those two things. As a member of the Boston Performance Group, you can go to several places. You can come here and do hill repeats on Cricket Hill. You can go to Barrington and run the Barrington Hills, or you can come and visit us at the Morton Arboretum. I actually have two hills that we practice our downhill running on. One is called Accelerator Alley, and the other one is called Downton Arby. Once again, this is Fred Fidoa with the Boston Performance Group. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, visit the Chicago Area Runners Association website, careruns.org.